What's next at Wildlife in Need? Well, today the case one step closer to being finished as the state of Indiana presented its final evidence against Tim Stark alleging, alleging embezzlement, mismanagement, and animal neglect. And Stark maintaining that the entire case is a massive injustice. Shay McAllister, who first broke the story of claims of animal abuse, is covering the case in Indianapolis. It was a roller coaster of emotion in this courtroom today, as it has been on every court date in this case so far. Lots of tense moments, yelling, profanity, and even some tears. It's difficult, but uh, you know, we soldier on and try to, I try to, my team and, and myself, we try to remain calm and do our job and get the answers that we need. No cameras allowed inside the courtroom once proceedings were underway, but today we heard from the state as they presented their case, laying out serious accusations of nonprofit mismanagement. No formal meetings, no records, no votes on financial decisions. A breakdown, they say, that ultimately led to animal neglect. They also describe embezzlement, including Stark using wildlife and need donations from the public to pay for personal dinners, gas, hair appointments, and utility bills. And Stark didn't deny it. On the stand, he said, quote, wildlife in need paid for my existence and still does today. But Stark says it's not so black and white. He says the nonprofit became so successful by using his animals, his property, and his equipment. And he says he plans to prove that in court tomorrow. Tomorrow's your day to present your case. What is your plan? My plan is destroy as many people as I can. I have the proof. I told you. I've been waiting on it. If the judge allows me, and I don't mean that I'm going to attack him and jump on him, well, I'm going to attack him legally, and I'm going to expose what I've been waiting for five years because now I'm going in reverse. Stark went on to explain that he sees tomorrow as his chance to explain all of the misunderstandings and lies that have landed him in five years of lawsuits. The state wrapped up today. Tim Stark presents his evidence starting at 9 a.m. tomorrow morning. In Indianapolis, I'm Shay McAllister.